So the last weeks we had a bit of downtime. So we had some time to, uh, to do some experiments and try to figure out how to do virtual production with Blender. Um, but this is still a work in progress. Um, so since we had some downtime, our team had some downtime as well. And they had some time to do some experiments, like to learn Python and uh, do some sculpting and some other things. Um, and one day I walked into Clement's uh, office and he showed me like coding and uh, painting and watery stuff and I had no idea what it is. And apparently uh, he has been developing an add-on for Blender to paint flow maps, which I still don't know what it is, but I'll show you. Come with me. Uh, mind the stairs. <laughs> Come on, don't be shy. Come on. Come with me. Come here. It's right there. Hang on. So, could you explain me what flow map is? What are you doing there? Yeah. What is it? Flow map. I can uh, just show you. So, look at that. That are flow maps. A flow map is basically an app um, which captures the direction of the brush movement in color data. So you can think of it like that, the red and the green channel of the color are like the axis of the vector in which the brush is moving. And yeah, so let's just show it in Blender so you can understand it better. So here we have the river scene which is currently um, Play. And here you can see the flow map add on. And yeah, you can just hit this button, you get the brush, and the brush is getting the color. Now you can paint. And also, you can let the animation play while you paint. That's so cool. And yeah, you can. You get a bit closer to the rock maybe and then the like strength a bit down. Now you can paint a bit around the rock so that the water flows actually around the rocks. Awesome. Yep. Okay, so how do I get it? Can, I want to use it. This is cool. But where are yeah, you get it? It's actually free, uh, available on Gumroad slash Clemens Pointer. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so I guess we'll put the link in the description below. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there is the link. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. And, and Clemens said to me that, uh, of course, not only can you use it for, for a water simulation, but also to comb the textures. So he's built a node setup that translates the flow map direction into rotation. So Silke can show you now how to comb your textures with a flow map. Oh, well. Yeah, here yeah, oh, it's um, by default mapped on, on the crest. Here on the wings, I, I've already painted a little bit. Yeah, okay, the add on. And now you can comb the sky. So. Super cool. <laughs> Thank you.